Unify has been a household name for many network engineers for quite some time, but recently they've been breaking into enterprise IT with their new hardware and software designed for scale, reliability, and performance. Ubiquity is setting its sights on some pretty big players. And in today's video, we're doing a deep dive into their enterprise offering. We'll start with the hardware and then explore some powerful software innovations behind it all. So stay tuned, this is not gonna be one you're gonna wanna miss. First up, the Enterprise Campus Aggregation Switch. This beast is purpose-built for high-throughput environments like data centers and large campuses. It features 48 SFP28 ports, each capable of 10 or 25 gig, along with six QSFP28 ports supporting 40 and 100 gig. Together, these ports deliver a massive 1.8 terabytes per second of non-blocking throughput and a 3.6 terabit per second switching capacity. It ensures seamless data flow across the network. Uptime and reliability are crucial for enterprise network, and this switch delivers it with dual hot swappable 550 watt power supply modules and five hot swappable fan modules. This means no downtime during maintenance or hardware replacement. Next, let's talk about the Enterprise Campus PoE switches. Available in both a 48 and 24 port configuration, the 48 PoE model features 32 10 gig PoE++++ boards and 16 two and a half gig PoE++++ boards. Capable of delivering up to 90 watts per port, this is perfect for powering devices like Wi-Fi 7 access points or high-end IoT devices. The 24 port model scales down slightly, offering 16 10 gig PoE++++ ports and 8 2.5 gig PoE++++ ports, while maintaining all layer 3 functionality and reliability of its larger sibling. These models pair perfectly with the ECS aggregation for a spine leaf architecture to provide as much redundancy from the core to the access layer as possible. Unify's move to the enterprise wouldn't be complete without a cutting edge wireless solution. Enter their E7 series Wi-Fi 7 access points. The E7 is a high performance access point designed for small to medium spaces and it supports 10 spatial streams, 6 GHz Wi-Fi 7, PoE++ for power, and can handle over 1,000 devices simultaneously, making it ideal for offices or classrooms. This access point also has a 10 gig RJ45 port and one gigabit RJ45 port for power and data redundancy. So we have full redundancy even to the AP now. Next is their E7 Campus. For larger spaces, the E7 Campus is the go-to solution with 10 spatial streams and directional antennas. It delivers optimized coverage for up to 5,000 square feet, perfect for auditoriums or open workspaces. You also receive the same 10 gig and 1 gig ports for data and redundancy while still being powered over PoE++. This AP can be both mounted indoors or outdoors for the ultimate coverage and flexibility. And last but not least, the E7 audience. It takes it up a notch with 12 spatial streams, advanced RF filtering, and an IP68 waterproof rating for weather resistance. This AP includes all the same ports and features from the U7 campus, but includes a selectable directional beam forming antenna. This antenna can be either at 15 dBi using a 50 degree angle or 11 dBi at 90 degrees, which allows for cell size optimization. Plus it's got a pretty cool screen on it. Finally, we have the Enterprise Fortress Gateway EFG and the Gateway Enterprise. These devices pack serious routing power with support up to 12.5 gigabits per second, both IDS and IPS enabled. Both models come with two 25 gig SFP28 ports, two 10 gig SFP plus ports, and two two and a half gig ethernet ports, giving you plenty of flexibility for your WAN and LAN configurations. They also feature VRP based high availability, which ensures uninterrupted connectivity even during failover scenarios. And with AI powered next packet inspection, your network remains secure without sacrificing performance. Unify's hardware is impressive, 
But what really sets it apart is the software. The Unify Network 9.0 platform provides powerful tools for managing large, complex networks. The first exciting addition is Hub & Spoke SD-WAN. This architecture is designed for multi-site deployments, providing efficient and centralized management of network traffic. In a hub and spoke setup, the central hub acts as the main control point connecting directly to remote spokes. This design ensures optimal routing for critical applications and improves performance for distributed enterprises. With intelligent traffic management, you can prioritize bandwidth for specific services while dynamically routing traffic through link failures. Plus, integrating with Unify software makes it easy to monitor and manage your entire SD-WAN infrastructure from just a single pane of glass. Hub & Spoke SD-WAN is ideal for uh, businesses with branch offices, retail locations, distributed data centers that are connecting to core critical branch offices, or really any environment that just requires consistent connectivity across multiple sites. Let's talk about stacking. This feature allows multiple switches to operate as one single unit. Simplifying management and improving scalability, this feature when paired with MC lag provides not only inner stack redundancy, but redundancy at the core too. This would be a common use case when you have multiple racks that operate around a campus or a data center that come back to a redundant set of core switches and gateways. You can add or replace switches without disrupting the network, a game changer for large deployments. On the gateway side, high availability mode ensures network uptime. By leveraging VRRP, the network automatically fails over to a backup gateway if the primary one goes offline. VRRP has been around for some time, but for Unify to make a user interface around this protocol has been amazing to see come to life. It's truly as easy as just connecting another gateway and enabling shadow mode. This seamless transition keeps your business, campus, government entity, large enterprise network, whatever it is, running without interruption. For dynamic routing, Unify now supports BGP, allowing your network to connect with multiple ISPs or manage large-scale routing tables this is essential for enterprise environments with multiple sites or redundant internet connections, or customers who just have IP ranges that they're attempting to advertise for whatever purposes they want to. Finally, the feature we've all been waiting for, multi-chassis link aggregation protocol or MCLAG. This feature allows you to connect devices to two switches simultaneously for redundancy and load balancing. Think of traditional lag or ether channel, but instead of two links to one switch, now you have links going to two different switches. This enables us to have full redundancy from the gateway all the way down to the access layer of our networks. If one switch fails, the other one takes over without disrupting connection to the downstream device. It's purely seamless and it enables so much more redundancy all the way through our entire network, top to bottom. With enterprise-grade hardware and software, Unify is stepping into a new era of networking. While their current iteration of enterprise features is still evolving, there's no denying they've come a long way. It's not perfect yet, but Ubiquity is paving a clear path forward and staying committed to bringing true enterprise capabilities to the table. Whether you're deploying a data center or managing multiple campuses, Unify's ecosystem is one to watch as it continues to grow. What do you guys think about the official move into the enterprise networking? Definitely let us know down in the comments below if any of you guys are planning to move to Unify for your enterprise deployment. Also, don't forget to reach out if you guys have any projects you'd like us to get involved in. Just take a visit to the link in the description to learn a little bit more about us. And don't forget to subscribe for more deep dives into the latest tech. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next one.